Hey, hey, Druid, welcome in, welcome in. <laughs> Shampoo ad, oh no. Hey, Druid. Ugh. How are you doing today, Druid? Ah. We're on fucking chapter 20. That is insane to me. We're on chapter fucking 20. <laughs> hey Mel Fucking don't remind me I have too much homework to do tonight For how early I have to go to bed For how early I have to go to bed tonight I have way too much homework It's my own fault Because I know I fucking procrastinated it Hey I'm Lemp, hey Crooked Hey Half, how you doing? Doing good, doing good Oh, hold on. I'm doing good, y'all. Grab a snippy snip. Okay. Twitch be lagging. Okay, see you when you refresh, Mel. <laughs> oh, let's show it off. I want to show you guys. <laughs> Get this show on the road. Browser! Fucking bright as always. But here, I want to show you guys. These are the glasses I got. So, these glasses, these are going to be like my normal prescription glasses with my new prescription. These ones are going to be the sunglasses and they're going to have like a gray tint on them. So, they look clear, but they're going to be sunglasses. So, those are going to be my regular glasses and those will be the sunglasses I'll use. For cosplay and if I ever decide to fucking do a face cam stream. But yeah. Those will be the ones I'll those will be my new normal glasses, which they're pretty similar to what my current ones are. They're just cheap. And then there these are gonna be the sunglasses, but they're gonna have a gray tint on them. They've got little stars in the corners in it, and I think that's so fucking cute. I just think that's so cute, because like they have little stars in the corner and stuff. <laughs> I don't know. I found them and they were cheap. Zenny is cheaper than some, but it isn't the cheapest. But yeah, that's where we're at. Okay, we're currently on chapter 20 of A Dragon's Instinct. Chapter 19 recap. Funeral pyre. It's a sad chapter. It was a sad chapter. Okay, we also need the time. I have so much in this thing. This folder's getting fucking huge. Oof. Oof, Lump. Okay. So we've got all that done. Hey, Eddie, welcome in, welcome in. You followed for Minecraft yesterday, but I tend to do some, like, different sort of stuff. I tend to do writing streams. Lots of writing. Lots and lots of writing. Okay, check the timeline. 
Okay, so we need to get Zuko and G back. Mwah! Three months, Pog. What the fuck? Mwah! What's the third month with Prime? Thank you so much, Mwah. Seriously, this means the absolute world. Seriously. It means so fucking much. Stream Elements is funky, though. Hey, Rose. Good morning, good morning. Hey, Effa, how you doing? How you doing, how you doing? How's everybody doing this morning? Just how's people hanging out and stuff like that? <laughs> Morning, 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 morning. I need to figure out how to do it the right way. Because the way I have, like, the goals and stuff set up, it doesn't, like... It doesn't go by totals. Cause like, it won't automatically, like if subs expire, it won't automatically drop those and then count the resub. So I keep having to go back in and stuff and like adjust the numbers to be correct. Ugh. But how is everyone doing this morning? Just like hanging out, all that fun crap. Bum, 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 bum. Mm, mm, mm. Okay. So we need to get Zuko and G back to the ship, but we also need to introduce the 41st point of view once the 41st gets back to the deck. Okay. So that means... Okay. We ended off mid-flight. So... Let's start with Zuko flying over top of the 41st procession and then heading back towards the Wani. Day four of going to the gym. Fucking Pogros. That is very Poggers. I have not been to the gym in a long fucking time and I need to. I really need to go to the gym, but. Yeah. That's very unlikely to happen. I need to. But am I going to? Probably fucking not. Water. I mean, like, I walk around campus and, like, I take my skateboard places. I... Oh, I hate waking up early. But I, I should be doing homework. There's a lot of homework I should be doing. But I just don't. So, yeah. Yeah. Mm -mm 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 Skater boy. Yes, because my galaxy longboard and helmet that I've drew over with Sharpies makes me a skater bull. <gasps> I got my board in Texas in, like, September when I was in down in Texas. I got it secondhand off of another guy. And I've just had it since. Like, I couldn't... Once I came back to South Dakota, I couldn't use it for a while because obviously snow and ice and all that crap. So, like, once I got to campus, like, I really wanted to use it and stuff, but the weather just turned nasty. But it started warming up recently, so I've been able to use it. I actually took my board out on Monday. And so, I, I've told you guys that, like, I'm leasing an apartment for, like, the next year. And I took my board out, and I figured out how long it took me from my apartment to get to the, like, student union of campus. Which, like, gives me a basis for how long it'll take me to get to different areas of campus. It's like six minutes with my board. It took me like six minutes to make it from my apartment to the student union of my campus. 
which is not it's you it's like 10 minutes to walk somewhere to like most of my classes so with my board and as i get more confident with it being able to skate on it more i'm gonna be fucking zipping around campus and it's gonna be nice yeah, I spent the summer down in Texas. It wasn't fun, Rose. It, 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 it wasn't fun. I wish it was, but it wasn't fun. The most fun I had was I made a friend and he taught me how to ride a longboard. But otherwise, it, it wasn't fun, Rose. I'm sorry. It wasn't fun. <laughs> if I could go back and have fun, I would. But it wasn't fun. Couple other factors than that, Rose, that I'm not, like, that I'm not, like, sharing with chat but there was a couple other factors about why i was down in texas that didn't make it fun nope 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 texas was not fun the heat it act, it rained a, it rained a lot while i was down in texas it did rain a lot but that just made it very fucking humid but yeah i was down in texas for some reasons that didn't make being in texas very fun because i could go like nowhere we went to a water park one day. That was a lot of fucking fun. But like the first two months I was in Texas, not fun. The last two months, that, those were decent. Those were decent. But the first two months in Texas, uh-uh, not the shit, y'all, not the shit. Rose, it's probably a very beautiful state, but where I was, I didn't get to see a lot of it. <laughs> I couldn't go nowhere because of COVID lockdown. I was in Texas, but I didn't get to go nowhere. I did not get to go anywhere. So it's probably a very pretty state. and Very nice. I saw nothing. I literally, we saw nothing while we were there. We could go nowhere. And I was in Texas for four months. I was in Texas for four months. And I saw, we, we split the time between two towns. And yeah. We couldn't go anywhere because of the lockdown. It, yeah, so yeah, I did not have a fun time in Texas. But I was in Texas, and, like, the best part about being in Texas was, like, the second two months. So the second half of my trip. That was where I made a friend, and he, like... We actually made that friend... Oh, how did I meet him? I made that friend when we went to the water park. So, like... So, that trip was just, so my trip to Texas was distinctly split into two parts, the first two months and then the second two months. The second two months, about two weeks into the second two months, we went to a water park. And I had a couple friends that I made during the first two months that I went to this water park with. And because it was a water park and all that fun stuff and it was outside and all that stuff, we could be there, it was fun, having fun, chill and all that blast. She had a friend who, who she had, who she knew who was also there. And I ended up hanging out with that friend, and we just fucking chilled. He was really cool. Like, he was super cool and really chill and stuff. So, like, we became friends at that water park. Actually, fun story about that is sometimes... I have had a couple interactions with people where people don't know social cues. But the friend I made at the water park, bless his fucking heart. Man knew... How to get a creep to back off. We stan. <laughs> okay, so, summer, to, the longer story of that story is that, so the friend I made at that water park, we'll call him B. B and I had just met at that water park through our, through our mutual friend E. E knew B because E and B took classes together. But B and I had just met then. So we were hanging out, all that stuff. It ended up being, so the water park we were at had a lazy river. Both of us were pretty much done with, like, anything else we were doing that day. So we just got, like, a double inner tube, and we just went around that lazy river. But the thing is, B, super fucking chill. Like, ridiculously chill. The random guy. So another thing to preface is that I was down there. For like a large event kind of convention-y type thing. But not really. So we were. So there was a large group of us. Basically our group rented out this water park for the entire day. So everyone there was from our group. Like our big large group. But there was like a couple smaller groups inside the big groups. 
So, everyone there kind of knew each other. We all had similar backgrounds, similar reasons for being at that water park. Like, everyone at the same time. So, B was with me on the double inner tube just floating around the lazy river. This random guy just pops up and starts hanging off the edge of our inner tube. Which, like, since we were all from the same group, giant trains of inner tubes had been forming all day in the lazy river. Just, like, gigantic trains of inner tubes had been forming, like, all day long. But, like, B and I, we were just, like, floating just by ourselves. And then this random guy just latches onto our tube. And it's fucking creepy. Especially the way he started trying to latch onto it. So he was, like, grabbing onto the handle, but then he was, like, trying to hook his feet up on the inner tube. And his feet went to my side of the inner tube. And that was a fucking nopers. And B was just like, dude, get the fuck away. Like, B threatened to throw hands, which would not have been good to cause conflict in our group. But B threatened to throw hands for me. And that's how I know I made an awesome friend. And then once we got back to, like, our main area where our group was staying, he, like, he knew how to skateboard. Like, so, like, he, we started keeping, we kept hanging out more after that. And then eventually he taught me how to longboard and then I got my own longboard. And that's like what I did for fun like the second, like the last two months of my trip to Texas. Was like there was this big parking lot and like the close to where we were staying. And just it was usually pretty empty. Like that parking lot usually only had like three or four cars in it. And it was a smooth parking lot. So that's where B taught me how to longboard. And then once I got a hang of it, I just cruised that parking lot in circles for hours. I definitely had a hyperfixation on my longboard for a couple weeks. It was ridiculous. But yeah, for a couple weeks, I definitely had a hyperfixation on my longboard. And it was so much fun, though. Where the fuck has my train of thought led me? Fuck's sake. We're 20 minutes into the stream and I haven't written a single word. This is what just chatting streams are for me. Athens Spock joined the fam. Hey Athena, welcome in, welcome in. How are you doing today? So this is what my just this is what my, my writing streams are. It's just follow the ADHD brain train. My writing streams are just follow the ADHD brain train. That's all that happens. That is all that happens during these. That is all that happens during these streams, is just follow the ADHD train. We're just chilling with the music, and next thing I know, we're just fucking ugh, brain. Uh, we are currently trying to write the chapter 20 of A Dragon's Instinct, which is a fanfic for Avatar The Last Airbender. And it's really fun, except chat distracts me so much. I get so lost on my, like, ADHD brain tangents that it's very hard to be productive. But it's so much fun, because it's just talking to chat about completely random stuff. Just talking and talking and talking and talking, and not doing the purpose of the stream, which is writing a chapter. <laughs> Blimp, no. It is not... No one should be sorry for distracting me. It is fun. I am having fun talking to you guys. I like talking to you guys. It's no one's fault. I am not blaming anyone. It is fully on my brain and getting completely sidetracked. If I wanted to, I could ignore you guys and write, but that's not the point of this. Just chatting is so that I can talk to chat. <laughs> <laughs> tag which is something lots of things don't even have tags for them lots of things like don't even have tags and stuff so like at least the fact that we have a writing tag that helps out a lot so <laughs> oof that sounds like lots of fun rows I was just about 
walked across my legs again. Fucking fine. Feet on the ground, sit up straight. Uh, how are you doing today, Mystic? Uh, feet on the ground, sit up straight, and let's fucking write something. Uh, what were we doing? We were going with Zuko has to fly over the 41st and then head back to the ship. Because we've got to get to the 41st perspective. <laughs> ah. Bump with our daily dose of quack! What the fuck, Rose? What the fuck, Rose? Blimp with our daily dose of quack. <laughs> okay, Mystics. Well, have fun at the doctor. Okay, so another story time. Yesterday, I went to the optometrist to get a new prescription and stuff because I need to update it because last time I got my eyes checked was like two years ago, except when it was in Texas. For some reason, out of everything I did in Texas, I got, I went to an optometrist while I was in Texas over the summer. Don't know why, but of everything I did in Texas, I went to the optometrist during, during those two months, the first two months. In Texas. I... Back to the original story. I went to the optometrist yesterday. And at my optometrist visit and stuff, like, I was just doing that. So, I don't know if you guys saw it, but I tweeted out while I was at the optometrist. Hold on. I tweeted while I was at the optometrist. Ugh. Profile. So, I tweeted while I was at the optometrist. And I tweeted... Where is it? Getting fitted for new eyes. What color should I get? <laughs> And I, it did, Lazzy responded. We love Lazzy. We love Lazzy. Lazzy for the responses. But yeah. Lazzy with the responses. Getting fitted for new eyes. What color should I get? <laughs> and that was just hilarious to me. But yeah. Just fun. So, like, if you guys want, there you do. You guys do get like stream updates and stuff, like when I'm going live and crap like that. So, tweets and replies. I don't do a lot of tweeting except like responding to other members of the Grand SMP. <laughs> toffee art, toffee art, toffee appreciation art. Look at this. Fucking look at it. Bunny and Silky, look at there's me. There's a Grouch. There's a people. There's an Inu. There's a Goose. 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 Silky. Isa. Ah! Look at Pandemics. Ah! Toffee Art Appreciation. Hey, Gin Mog. And look at it. There's more Inu. And there's a Silky. There's a Bunny. And there's a Goose. Look at them. Toffee Art is fucking amazing. Yeah, that's my prescription. That's my fucking prescription. My eyeballs are broken, people. My eyeballs are broken. My eyeballs are broken. Eyeballs are fucking broken, y'all. Notifications. Tweets! Okay, that's enough tweeter. We're 25 minutes in and I still haven't written a single fucking word. Uh, legally blind is if your vision is 20 out of 200. And I don't know what my 2020 is. Legally blind is 20 out of 200 vision. So, like, what people see at 200 feet, you can only see at 20. The decimal numbers? Hold on, I'll pull it back up. <laughs> no, we have been very unproductive today. Very unproductive today. Huh? What ones?
So that's the like the correction I need. And then I have a slight astigmatism in my left eye. So that's what those numbers mean. And this is my pupil distance. So this is like the distance between my pupils. So like my right eye, my, that pupil is 30.5. And then on my left eye, it's 32. So basically that's just how wide my frames of glasses need to be. <laughs> I'm just like reading the prescription and stuff. It's pretty simple if you've had glasses for most of your life like I have. Okay, back to business. chair because it's fucking wood and shit fucking pillow pillow on the chair i need to get like an actual office chair but i probably at this point it's not worth it to get it to put in my dorm so like i'm just gonna deal with this rocking monstrosity that my dorm room provides me and just get an office chair at my apartment you know what's messed up is that i will probably have a fully set up desk and streaming system before I get a fucking bed frame in that apartment. Gonna be honest, because furniture is fucking expensive. Furniture is fucking expensive, y'all. Like, I've been looking at it and stuff. Furniture is expensive. Why is furniture so expensive? Okay, I lied. Sitting on the pillow feels fucking weird. Suffer. Fucking put my feet down. Don't sit cross-legged on the chair. <sighs> why are Fridays like this? Why are Fridays like this, guys? Why are Fridays like this? Sitting in chairs cross-legged is comfy, but it can't be good for me. It is not going to be good for me. I spend so long at a desk anyway, that if I sit in my chairs cross-legged all the time, it's going to be a fucking nightmare. just realized there was a piece of cereal hiding in my little mini figurines on my desk. I don't have a lot on my desk besides, like, my setup. Like, for, like... Basically, my desk is just my computer, except for the bottle of fucking Zycam, and then the four mini figurines on my desk. And even though they're just like little dudes, doodads off to the side of my keyboard and stuff, they just sit there and look cute. Put the bottle of Zycam in the desk drawer. The desk drawer, on the other hand, is a fucking mess. There's a phone USB, there's pens, there's coins, calculator, sharpies, scissors, nail clippers, a Zycam bottle that I just put in there. A plastic fork and knife, a half-eaten brownie, that's still in the wrapper, so it's still good, fruit snacks, a granola bar, a hair tie, 
and random pieces of paper. Ooh, chapstick. The thing where you never remember to use chapstick until you randomly find it. Shit! <laughs> Why do I do this every stream? <laughs> Why do I do this every stream? I'm eating fruit snacks now. Every stream, I end up going through my desk. <laughs> I'm finishing off the pack of fruit snacks. Wrapper. Crinkly. Fruit snacks. Chewy. Yay. Gummy candies are my favorite type of candies. They're so good. See, the thing is, I lose track of where my chapstick is. So I have like one of those Eos eggs things, and it bounces between either my purse or my backpack. And I'm currently not sure where it is, but I really want to go check now. I think it's in my purse, but if it's not in my purse, then it's in the abyssal bottom of my backpack. It's, my chapstick is either in my purse or my backpack, and I'm not sure where. See, Lemp, I had braces for nine, nine, maybe ten years. Okay, if I got... I started like my dental work when I was nine, then I had a break, a year of break in high school, and then I got them off right before I graduated. So that means, so I probably got them like, I got them when I was nine. So nine to 10, that's one year. So nine, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15. I think the break year was when I was 16. So then 17 and then 18. It was only like half a year. It's like eight or nine years of braces. I didn't fucking listen to the what you should and shouldn't eat at all. I chewed gum. I ate gummies. I ate popcorn. All that shit. For like eight or nine years. I didn't fucking listen. I didn't break off brackets because of food. I broke brackets just because there was so much tension on my fucked up teeth. Because my teeth were so fucked up, there was just so much tension and that would cause brackets to pop off. I'm actually not, Mystics. My ankles are crossed, but they're still on the ground. Braces fucking sucked. Well, I didn't start with braces braces. I started with what they called an archer because they needed to expand my jaw and move my jaw forward. So from like nine to 11 or 12, I think, I had an archer and I had to wear fucking headgear. I had archers and expanders in. Because my jaw was too small for my teeth. So for like two or three years, I had an archer in my mouth. And it came with a little key on a hand thing that my mom would stick into the slot and crank to expand my jaw out. And we did that like three times a week. And they fucking sucked. They fucking sucked, y'all. And then the fucking headgear. The fucking headgear. Nightmares, y'all. Fucking nightmares. That shit hurt. Why can you guys never get me telling stories when I'm playing Minecraft and doing boring stuff like terraforming? Why is it whenever I try and sit down and write that you guys get me going on story tangents? <laughs> oh.
<laughs> ADHD brain, y'all. ADHD brain. I, I, okay. <laughs> Keep talking to me. Keep talking to me. I like talking to chat. <laughs> it is. It really is. Keep getting fucking notifications. Phone, shut up. I don't have dyslexia or like uh, dyscalculia or anything like that, but I can't tell my left and my right apart. Yesterday when I was at the opt optometrist, they kept asking me to cover my left and my right eye. I had to keep making the fingers. I had to keep making the fucking fingers. The L for my left eye. I had to keep doing it so many times because they kept asking me to close my left or my right eye and I had to keep on doing it because otherwise I couldn't figure it out. I just, uh, why is left and right so hard to tell apart? It shouldn't be, but it is. This calcula. This calcula is a thing. This calcula. Math learning disability. Number dyslexia. It's fine, Mystic. Lots of people don't know about it, but it is an actual thing. It's perfectly fine, Mystic. Lots of people don't know about dyscalculia. I don't even know if I'm saying it right. I think I'm saying it right. Fucking, yeah. Letters and numbers aren't fun. But yet, here I am writing fanfic. I can't spell. Get llama. Pride llama. Llama pride. Unicorn llama. Llama. 
Lama. <laughs> Look at them! They're adorable! Holy shit! Why is there so many designs for this? <laughs> Alpacas. Okay, alpaca. Minecraft. What is this pop up? Nothing interesting. I should know better than to Google sp very specific things on stream. I should know better. But do I? Fuck no. Sad llama, happy llama. Llamas! My uncle has llamas, I think. Is it llamas or does he have alpacas? He has one of them, I'm pretty sure. Zimas joined the fam. Zimos, thank you so much for the follow. <laughs> No, Zemos, we are following the ADHD brain train and going down a fucking rabbit hole everywhere. But we're having fun, so that's what counts, Zemos. <laughs> doing our best, doing our best, but I keep getting distracted. <laughs> Hi, Zemos, how you doing today? Gay Lama is in the art channel of Discord. Oh, now I must see this. <laughs> nice, Mystics. That is so cute. That is so cute, Mystics. Uh, we are currently working on A Dragon's Instinct Chapter 20. A Dragon's Instinct is a rewrite story I'm doing of the Avatar The Last Airbender universe, where Zuko is a dragon shapeshifter. That's what we are writing right now. We are working on Chapter 20. And we're kind of just chilling, but mainly we keep getting lost on ADHD brain train tangents. <laughs> Like X-Men? Uh, no, not really, but we're having fun and that's kind of what matters. Basically, the premise is that Zuko is basically going to do Aang's job for him. So by the time Aang gets back, there's like nothing for him to do. But it's mainly just going to be a lot of fun. And currently we just finished up like the first big like battle arc in chapters. So we're currently regrouping before we set off for the next arc. Which is fun, but I need to focus and write. Okay. I mean, I guess. I guess, Zemos. Kind of like X-Men. But it's Prince Zuko and Avatar The Last Airbender. Which is fun. We're mainly just vibing with it. Having lots of fun. Chilling with chat. It's been fucking 46 minutes into stream and I've written... What's my word count? 133 words. Productivity is at an all-time high right now. But we're mainly chilling right now. <laughs> I 
I feel that, Mystics. I actually have. I have to submit a topic proposal and, like, a beginning of an annotated bi bibliography tonight for my final essay for my comp class. I haven't thought about it at all. <laughs> I love writing. Writing is so much fun, but I get so distracted. Which is fine, because I love talking in chat. Hold on, I just realized something. There we go. Mystics? <laughs> if you keep posture checking me, I'm gonna fucking, fucking fine. <sighs> I, I, <laughs> I, uh, I, I have no defense. I have no defense. Feet on the ground, back up straight. <laughs> hey, Kestros, how you doing? Oh. <laughs> oh. Lonely Carflo joined the fam. Lonely Carflow, thank you so much for the follow. How are you doing today? I hit caps lock. Did I? No, I didn't hit caps lock. I just hold, held shift too long. But how are you doing today? Welcome in, welcome in. Yes, Kestros, they are bullying me to have good posture. And the fucking thing is, is that I don't realize when I start sitting cross-legged and stuff. So every time they call me out, I realize that uh, what I'm sitting like. <laughs> I <laughs> Tangents and posture bullying. That's what the stream title should be. Tangents and posture bullying. <laughs> oh. <laughs> oh, I need water. But we're literally just vibing, following ADHD brain tangents, and you guys are bullying me about sitting with good posture. Fuck. I'll call it out. Hello, everyone. This is your daily reminder from your local streamer. If you have not had any water in the last hour, go get some now. If you have had not had any water, if you have not had any food in the past six hours, go get some now. If you have been sitting for too long, stand the fuck up. <gasps> song. I love this song. Lies your 
breaking through the mist on in the daylight I'm my happy ending and running knowing I'll find my home someday I will take it back take it all back no strong Someday I will find my own way home Someday. I fucking love this song I fucking love this song All Derivacat songs are fucking amazing Songs of the S&P by Derivacat Fucking amazing this playlist fucking banks, except for Blue. I don't like you. I don't like Blue. It's a good song still, but I don't like it. Good song. Yeah, lonely, go get water. Oh. <laughs> Good luck at the doctor, Mystics. If you have been awake for the past six hours and you have not eaten, go get food, Zymos. Six hours awake. You should eat food. Because if you spend like 18 hours awake, that means you should eat three meals. So if you have not had anything to eat in at least the past six hours, if not the past four hours, go get something to eat. Water in the past hour, and if you need to, go take your fucking meds. Oh no, Mel. A song fic? No, I haven't actually. There's been a couple songs where, like, they've been, like, really inspiring and crap. No, wait. It wasn't a song fic. But it was a story based off of a song. So, technically, I have. Technically, I have. What is this? Say, you've been a bad girl. What the fuck, Mel? Mel, what the fuck? It literally, it just says that. <laughs> I can't, I don't know how to not let stream hear it. No. <laughs> okay. <laughs> okay, guys, for context. Mel sent me a TikTok. Mel sent me like a downloaded TikTok of techno. And it, basically the TikTok starts with, I forgot that this video of techno existed. And then techno just says that. Mel. <laughs> nice rose. Okay, lonely. Lonely. That's not good. That's your body shutting down and starting to go off of your fat reserves. Go get food. Now. That's not normal. That's not your body being weird. That's your body shutting down your hunger response and starting to consume your body fat. Go get food. Not feeling hungry after not eating for so long? That's bad. That is very bad. That means your body, your brain has shut off your hunger receptors 
and is starting consuming the body fat. Go get food. Seriously, go get food. I'm not joking. That's why I say every six hours. If you have been awake and have not eaten in the past six hours, or if you just woke up this morning, go get food. If you don't eat for so long and you don't feel hungry, that's because your brain has shut off your hunger receptors, like the signals in your brain, and is starting to consume your body fat. Lonely, I promise you, you can find something to eat. You can find something to eat somewhere. Earrings? I have my ears pierced, but I don't really wear earrings. I have my ears pierced, but I don't really wear them. I wear them sometimes. But I promise lonely, even just something small like a snack, or even if you just have a drink that has calories, but you need to get calories in your body. I'm serious, lonely. You need to get calories in your body. Fucking fine. Uh Hold on, I'm gonna have to find my other pair of headphones because my because if I unplug my headphones from my speakers, then you guys will hear the music doubled. Hold on. So I gotta find my other headphones. Where's my earbuds? Earbuds! Okay, I found my earbuds and I'll fucking listen to it, Mel. But seriously, Lonely, get something with calories in your body. You can probably find a drink or something that has some calories in it. Fucking fine, Mel. I'll listen to it. Actually, techno. There is no way that is actually techno. There is no way that that is an actual techno audio. Okay, I thought so. I thought so, Mel. I thought so. Fucking shit. Fucking shit. Y'all are awful people. Awful people, I say. Awful people. Yes, Lonely. Go cook the eggs. Go make food. If you want to ask Mel to send it to you, but I ain't playing that on stream. I the, No, that, I'm pretty sure that's TOS. The whole audio, I'm pretty sure, is TOS. I ain't playing that on stream. If you want to ask Mel to DM it to you, fine. But I ain't playing that on stream. Uh-uh. Uh-oh. <laughs> no, Mel, do not put it in media. If they want it, they can DM you for it, Mel. If they want it, you they can DM you for it, Mel. But holy. Mel. Where did you even find that? <laughs> that audio <laughs> we are an hour into the stream and i haven't even written 200 words we ain't finishing a chapter today it ain't gonna happen When your mod sends you something TOS to listen to, you accidentally play like the first three seconds, and then they want a fucking live reaction. I, I can't. Another Derivative Cat song is on, but I can't sing this one. I don't know this one well enough, but I love this song. I'm cranking my volume, but I'll leave it the same for you guys. You're the one who was saying. <laughs> Keep your distance. 
say I'm a traitor, but I can't remember all in my head now. It all is the same. All in my head now. I think I might go insane. <laughs> I almost know the song better than I thought, but eh. This is the Rambu theme song. Okay, let's go, let's go, let's go. Well, see, the thing is, there's a difference between, like, knowing the songs, because that was... That was In My Head by Derivacat, that one. Like, I've listened to so many of these songs so many times on repeat, so, like, I know them. But, like, knowing them enough to, like, confidently sing them, that those are two separate things. But, like, Ain't No Crying and Syndicate, those ones I can fucking belt. And 4AM. Ain't No Crying, Syndicate, and 4AM, I can fucking belt. I know those songs so well. Actually, hold on. Is this on the... Add to playlist, stream playlist. Okay. Don't add. So it is on there. And also, I don't know if you guys saw, but I added a karaoke points option. So if you guys want, you can pick, like, a Derivacat song for me to sing. Pretty much. Since those are, like, the ones I confidently know. But it did not save. I don't see it on there. What the fuck? I thought I added it. Where did it go? I thought I added it. That's not good. I thought I added that. Hold on. Ah! Back to Twitch. Hold on. I thought I had added that points reward. That would explain why no one has fucking redeemed it, even though I know you guys have points. I fucking set it up. I know I did. Bum, bum. Ba -da -da -da. added it.
Okay. Fucking. <gasps> fucking. My fucking heart. Why? <sighs> I added it three times. What the fuck? It's on the. Why is it on there three times? Okay, it's there. Why is it on there so many times? I didn't mean to add it three times. What is this? No, karaoke on. Enable it. Fuck you, you bitch. I don't know, is it still there? Hold on. I may have messed stuff up. Is it gone now? Why do they keep appearing and disappearing? I'm trying to get it set up to work, but I don't, I can't, I, 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 I fucked it up, y'all. I fucked it up. Okay. We'll try this one more time. Add custom reward. Okay, okay. Aylin sings. Syndicate. Ain't no crying for 4 a.m. Okay. Created. Hopefully I didn't fucking break it. Probably broke it again. Who knows? Okay, it's there. It's there. Fuck it, it's there. It, it, it shouldn't be. <laughs> okay, Druid requested Syndicate. Fucking fine. Fine. <laughs> syndicate it is. Hey, I'll tell you a little secret of mine. You promise not to tell if you have the time. Everyone is on you, always on the run. But if you join the syndicate, that could get a little more fun. All of the horses and all of the men won't learn from history, it's all the same in the end. I've told you once and I'll tell you again The syndicate is looking for a couple new friends Couple new friends Oh, 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 oh Fight for freedom Fight to end the pain Hey, this is serious, it's not just some little game Cause the anarchy's part of me, tyranny bothers me And it all commonly once and for all They call us the villains, say no, we'll take the fall and all of the horses and all of the men Won't learn from history, it's all the same in the end I've told you once and I'll tell you again The syndicate is looking for a couple new friends Oh, a couple new friends Oh, 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 oh Oh, 
album friends back to stream playlist Oof, loud this is normally song i start stream on if spotify cooperates with me uh if i know it effa maybe hey lexi how you doing how you doing lexi <laughs> uh maybe if i know the song and it's not using dmca we'll see but currently i know derivative cat songs aren't dmca and those are ones i know so that's why they're the options i am doing good lexi other than the fact of we are an hour and 13 minutes into the stream and i've written nothing we ain't finishing a chapter today it just ain't gonna happen which sucks, but that's what ADHD brain says happens. Chaos. That is all it is. That is all the stream is. The stream is chaos. That's all it is. Though we've had... Is it only three or is it four followers this stream? Three followers this stream? Which, if you guys are still hanging around, fucking Pog, you guys are amazing. But at the same time, we're just gaining followers left and right. Which means we might be hitting 500 followers sooner than I thought. Which is terrifying. But also fun so the things to know about me cosplaying my character and doing like cosplay stuff pos probably like a couple tiktoks with cosplay and maybe a stream a face cam stream with like mask and sunglasses and stuff is the fact that one hold on i just completely lost what i was talking about hold up I had something I was going to say. Oh, I was talking about the things I ordered. So I've ordered this pr prescription sunglasses. So if we do that, I have sunglasses for that. But also, I ordered like one of those really cheap like cosplay corsets that, hold up, I can show you guys. I can show you guys. Hold on. Pictures. Okay, so this, hold up, actually, no, this was like the skin I've been using up until now for Minecraft. This is like the skin I've been using up until now. This pretty one, just simple like black dress, got the neck piece and the shoulder piece. This is the like new skin. This one is like more accurate to what the dress I will use, to like the dress I use for the cosplay will be with like the white shirt underneath it and all that stuff. So this one's more like accurate to the dress. But then I also made two like outfits. Where is the first one? Okay, that's second outfit. Where is... Okay, well this is one of the outfits. Which is a white shirt, black pants, and brown boots. But I also, it, I made it to where it has like a gold corset on it. And I ordered that corset. 
So I ordered that corset. So like if when we get to that point, oh, there's the first outfit. And this one, it's just basically switch around of black shirt, white pants with still the gold corset. So this, like these outfits are going to be a whole heck a lot easier to cosplay than the dress because the dress has a lace up back. The dress has like a corset lacing back and it's, it's too tight. Like if I want to put that dress on, I need someone to help me. And there's also the fact that the skirt on that dress is fucking massive. So it won't fit in my dorm room. But I don't move into my apartment until June 1st. So, as much as I fucking want to do the dress one, if I do the cosplay, it was probably a lot more fucking practical to do one of the outfits in cosplay. To do one of the outfits and then just do the dress when I get to my apartment. Eh, could maybe ask Faye. But at the same time, I still don't know exactly when we'll hit 500. And there's also the thing of, I just, the dress just doesn't fit. The dress just won't fit in my dorm room. It just won't fit in my dorm room. The hoop skirt that goes with the dress that this outfit would use. So like this dress is fucking massive. Do I have any pictures of it on here? Maybe in downloads? Do I have any pictures of it? Do I have any pictures of that dress on here? I should, I think. Maybe? Oh yeah, here it is. This is the dress I'm talking about, guys. This is the dress. Gold top, gold bottom, big fucking poofy skirt. The hoop skirt that goes underneath this is a four foot diameter. It don't fit in my dorm room. It just doesn't fit in my dorm room. This is the dress. Except when I wear it, I don't, I tuck in these sleeve bits and I wear a white dress shirt underneath it for like the look of the sleeves and stuff. But this is the dress. But the hoop skirt that goes underneath it is four foot in diameter. <laughs> so yeah, it just won't fit in my dorm room. Especially if I try and do, main thing with this dress is that I won't be able to fit at this desk with it. I will not be able to sit at the desk with it. So like I can wear this to probably film TikToks and like take pictures and stuff. But like to do a face cam stream, I'd probably have to do one of the outfits. Cause see, so you can kind of see how it matches up now with like the gold top and the gold on the bottom and a big black skirt. But the outfits, those are probably what I'll wear to do like face cam streams and stuff. So like, and those ones, those would be easy to do. I could do those in my dorm room. I'd have to fucking clean my dorm room, but I could do those in my dorm room. So depending on when we hit 500 followers, depends on what outfit you guys get. Cause first I also have to get the sunglasses and then I also have to get the corset to come in. But otherwise, and probably make the shoulder piece. Cause I kind of want to make the shoulder piece. Cause that's like a key part of the outfit that I've made. So I'd have to figure out how to make the shoulder piece. But yeah. So basically, whenever we hit 500 followers, I can fucking do it in like two weeks. If we hit 500 followers in two weeks, which that would be ridiculous growth. But if we hit 500 followers in like two or three weeks, I could do it. Oh yeah, I'm, I'm very smart about the fact of it's a cheap Amazon corset. It's like, it will not get laced tightly at all. It will literally be there for decoration. It will literally be there for decoration. It will have no actual function. It will be there for decoration. It will not get that tightly laced at all. It will literally be there for decoration. I have three Discord notifications. What do you old people want? Oh, Mel sending me stuff. I ain't Mel. I have Rombu PTSD from falling down. I ain't playing it on stream. I ain't playing falling down on stream because I'll make myself cry. I will make myself cry if I play falling down. <laughs> Morning. 
More messages from Mel. Adding the Minecraft songs to the stream playlist probably would be good, but at the same time, I'd probably confuse the fuck out of me. Because, like, if we just think about that one song by Matt Sharon that has the Minecraft sounds in it and how confused that made me. How confused that made me? Who? <laughs> Water. We have made no progress today. At all. Oh, gotta love it though, gotta love it. Hold up, did I reference Zuko as a he when G was talking? Okay, back to chapter 18. Okay, nope, we gotta go back to chapter 17. Okay, I did reference Zuko as a he earlier. Back in, back in chapter 17, G talked to him. You might have sent that a while ago, actually. Because I didn't look at chat for a couple minutes, and I actually got something done! Okay. 
Hey, CRS, how have you been? Really nothing that we know of. Because, like... Rand and Shaw. I Google this so many times. Rand and Shaw are very similar. Like, literally, Rand and Shaw are the same. Just, like, you can maybe go off of coloration. But, like, size-wise, all that sort of stuff, they're the same. Between Ran and Shaw, which we know are male and female, just because of their, like, like, their stuff. Are they? We don't know if they're male and female. We assume they are, don't we? Because of Druck? <gasps> Druck. Hey. Druck Avatar. Okay. Fire. Descending from the ancient firebending masters, Ren and Shaw. So that's why we assume Ren and Shaw are male and female, but we don't know who. I've said has made Ron the male and Shaw is the or Shao. Ooh. Hmm. Why do I have Discord pink? Oh, Phil probably went live. Yeah, it's noon. Noon on Friday. Phil went live. Hmm. <laughs> I mean, we fucking can. Why not? We can. I was just wondering. Because you, you mentioned it, Castros. But yeah, we don't fucking know. We don't know. Fucking nice.
Oof. Yeah. Toph as a boy just wouldn't have had the same impact. Fingernails are getting long. Quit picking up my fingernails. <sighs> I was doing so well. I was doing so well. And then I just, I looked at chat. Not that you guys are to blame, but I looked at chat and focus went, bye bye. There's a brownie in my desk and I want to bite a brownie right now. Snack break. Oh. I know I was. Snack time now. It's snack time now, Blump. Go eat a brownie. Oh. Um. Brownies are fucking pog. This one has Oreo bits in it. of brownie as a reward for when I get this thing fucking done or whenever I decide to wrap up stream
Thanks, Kastros. Stale brownies, ew. I got my brownie yesterday at lunch with my chicken strips and mozzarella. Chicken strips and mozzarella sticks. That was delicious, that was, that was good. That was good food. Hey, Knightley, how you doing? We're doing a lot of typing, though finishing a chapter today ain't gonna happen because I have a lot of homework that I gotta do. Like, I gotta learn an entire chapter of my accounting class and take a test. So, as much as I want to keep this going forever, we're probably gonna have to wrap up at some point without finishing the chapter, which sucks, but it's gonna have to happen. Typey, 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 typey. Everybody likes the clickety clackety of the keyboard. <laughs> I don't pay much attention to like the clicking clacking sound of my keyboard, but at the same time, I can understand why you guys would like it. I don't always get it, but I can see why you guys would like it. So I have a twist tie from the bag my brownie was in, because it was just in like one of those little like clear plastic baggies with just like a twist tie on it. So now I have the twist tie. Like, I'm looking at the little figurines that I have on my desk, and I'm, like, trying to see if there's, like, any holes that I can stick the zip, the twist tie through so I can hang them up somewhere. And, like, there's not, but I could maybe get the twist tie around the chicken. Trevor! Trevor has a seatbelt now. That means we twist this, and then we go up. Is it big enough? Is it big enough? It's not really big enough. <gasps> no, it works! <gasps> Trevor in the air. Trevor is in the sky now. 
Trevor, my beloved. Hold on. We can do this. We can do this, people. Trevor, my beloved. I have to show you guys a picture of Trevor at some point. So that you understand, Trevor, my beloved. show you a picture of Trevor. I'm going to show you a picture of Trevor now because Trevor is in the sky. They are now in the sky. <laughs> I must show you Trevor. I must show you guys Trevor. I must show you guys Trevor. Trevor is a beautiful, he's a beautiful little boy. Tommy upload finally uploaded the video about Drista on the SMP. Tommy finally uploaded the video about Drista. Fuck. Now I want to go watch that. But that. But I must show you Trevor in the sky. I must show you Trevor in the sky. Lots of people don't seem to know that the quickest way to get pictures from your phone to a computer is just put them in a draft of an email just put the pictures in a draft of the email of an email <gasps> look at them they are in the sky now that is trevor look at trevor trevor and his zombie friend yes the figurine is backwards technically but look at them Look at there's Trevor. Look at Trevor. <laughs> there's Trevor and that's his friend. I don't know what his friend's name is. I just know Trevor. And Trevor is adorable. I do not know the name of Trevor's friend, but Trevor is there and Trevor is adorable. I have so many more too. I think I've showed you some of them like in the past, but now you can see Trevor in the sky. Trevor in the sky. <laughs> oh, so cute. So, so freaking cute. So, I actually have a little piggy figurine. It's got a tulip on its head. It's so cute. And I've got a blue sheep, but the sheep has horns. It's Latin friend crossed. And I don't know how I feel about that. I don't know how I feel about the fact that I have a blue sheep, Minecraft sheep figurine on my desk, but it has ram horns. So it's a cross between friend and schlat. I don't know how to feel about that. And then also I have a skeleton that's holding rotten flesh for some reason. Because he's, ah! I dropped the skeleton, but I caught him. Mm-hmm. <laughs> we love emotes. We love emotes. <laughs> Isa Isa. I have so many emotes. I have so many subscriptions. Hold on. How many do I have? No, oh, what was that? Hey, hey Ellie. Join the fam. Hey, Ellie. How you doing? Ellie, 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 Ellie. I should probably follow you back too since you're on the SMP and everything. <laughs> I just realized that. Hey Ellie, how you doing? Uh, wallet. Not wallet. I need subscriptions. How many subscriptions do I have? I have one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Ten subscriptions. Well, yeah, I have 10 subscriptions, then I have 6 gifted subscriptions. For some reason. I've got 6 gifted subscriptions. Yeah. But yeah, I've got 6 gifted subscriptions, and I maintain 10 of them. One to Yellow, one to Iza, Fundy, Ronboo, Vague, Tubbo. Pyro. Though I don't. No, Pyro's is going to go for a couple more months. But then there's Phil, 
Eric and Tommy. I'm at six months on Tommy, Eret, Phil, and Pyro. I'm at... No, wait. I'm at six months on Tommy, Eret, Philza, Pyro, Tubbo. I'm at five months on Vague. I'm at four months on Rombu. Three months on Fundy. Two months on Iza. And two months on Yellow. Yeah. Very nice. Then I have a bunch of, like, gifted subscriptions that expired. I get gifted so many of subscriptions, it's ridiculous. I've gotten gifted to Matt Hoot, Foolish, Bird, Captain Puffy, Quackity, Puns, H-Bomb, Tango, Awesome Dude, and Finster. <laughs> Primes are pog. Primes are pog. Primes are very pog. But yeah, maintaining as many subscriptions as I do, it kind of adds up. But it's fine, because I love these people. Fundy was my comfort streamer for a while, but then... So, basically, I started with Eret. Eret was who got me into the Dream SMP. Eret was, like, my big comfort streamer. Then it was Filza. Then it was Fundy for a couple months. But recently, it's been Rombu. We salute Rombu. Good day, sir. Eret doesn't stream a lot, and that makes me sad. And Eret always streams at, like, the worst time. He always streams so late at night. I got into it because I was into Hermitcraft, but then I saw a Manhunt video, and I got fucking curious, and next thing I know... What? Eric was a super big inspiration to me for, like, starting streaming and stuff. But he just, he doesn't stream that much anymore, and it makes me so sad. Because, like, he's so funny, and he's so amazing. But, like, Rambu, Rambu is my... We love Rambu. Rambu is amazing. I am honestly a fucking diehard on Rambu. Ah! Okay, I'm posturing myself because I was twisted up in a fucking pretzel. Texting my mother in a meeting. Because my mother said I can't answer the phone anymore. I have to just, I just, I'm supposed to just text her in meeting.
It is my mother! My mother always seems to manage to call in the middle of the stream. I don't know how. But she, like, always manages to call in the middle of the stream. I don't know how. Because she called on Tuesday in the middle of the stream. Not mom pause, but mom distraction. So I'm going to leave my phone open with my texts from her open so she can text me back. Okay, but focus back in on this. Because, see, I've explained it and mentioned it a couple times, but my parents do not know that I stream. They do not. And if I tell them, that just causes more issues. So, yeah. We don't tell my parents that I stream. We don't tell my parents a lot of things. Love them, but we don't tell my parents a lot of things. Do I wish it could be different? Yes. Can it? Very unlikely. So, yeah. For a while, I would, like, mute my mic and answer the phone to my mom. But, like, I mentioned to her once that, I that like, I had picked up during a meeting. Because that's what I tell her I'm doing. I'm in meetings for freelance writing. Which is actually a thing I do. That's what this work bookmark... I don't know if you guys can see it. You guys can't see it. But up at the top of my browser, I have a bookmark that's just work. And that's the freelance writing website that I sometimes work with. But, like, I don't do a lot through there. But that's what she thinks I do, like, pretty much a lot. So my mom thinks I'm working as a freelance writer. Which, kind of, I guess, but not really. So, yeah, we'll, we'll just leave that there. Basically, we don't tell my mother. I wish it could be different, but you it very unlikely you guys will ever meet my parents. My siblings, you've already met the younger ones a couple times. Like, the OGs have met my younger siblings a couple times. Because I, when I used to live at home, like, back in December, I would be streaming. And my younger siblings, K and T, my youngest siblings, would come upstairs and they would, like, bug me and stuff. So, like, the OGs of stream and stuff, so just, like, basically, like, Toffee, has met my youngest siblings a couple times. Just, like, them coming in and saying hi and, like, talking and wondering what I'm doing and not realizing what it was. Because they're little. They're little, little. But, yeah. I wish I could be, like, Foolish and Sam and have my mom be a big part of my community, but, meh. Ain't gonna happen. Just is what it is. <sighs> My mother just asked me if I wanted to go to lunch. My mother just asked if I wanted to go to lunch. I mean, I could wrap up stream, but I also have a fuck ton of homework that I need to do. Like, I have to learn my entire accounting. Yes, it would be free food, but like, once stream is done, I have to learn my entire accounting chapter 8 and take a test on it, and then I have chemistry homework and a quiz to take, and then I have an essay proposal to write. The pressing matter is the accounting, which is due in five and a half hours. So, but food, I, <sighs> so my mom basically said, want to go to lunch with us, and I want to ask, who is us? Because if it's my dad, I ain't up for seeing my dad today. <sighs> Why is family 
so fucking complicated? Why is family so fucking complicated? <laughs> Ugh. Right? Is that knocking on my door or someone else's door? No, Hanako. It's Hanako. Not Tariko, it's Hanako. I've been reading Embers recently, that's why. But it's Hanako. I put Hanako in charge. I put Hanako inside, in charge. I put Hanako in charge, not Tariko. Ensign. Let's color Ensign Hanako.
Bye, Druid. That was a quick doctor's appointment, Mystics. Welcome back, though. Welcome back, welcome back. Uncross my fucking legs. Oh, bye, Blimp. Hey, bro.
Okay. We'll land Zuko on the deck, and that'll be where we'll wrap this stream up today. Didn't finish the chapter, but we can wrap this one up easily next time. We can wrap this chapter up easily on Monday once we get Zuko on the deck. Kiestros. Maybe not like make him look like he's clothed, but basically just like create a heat fog around him so nobody sees it. No one sees that he's naked naked. But Spotify. Why does this song have an extra 30 seconds at the end of complete silence? What's the point?
<laughs> Focus! Okay. Focus, 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 focus. Hey, butterfly! Focus, 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 focus. <laughs> oh. And that's where we'll wrap this up. We'll finish this chapter up next time. Because I want to get uh, some Hanako's point of view of the 41st making it back on deck. And the crew realizing that Zuko is, like out unconscious not just sleeping but like out unconscious and maybe dip back into the 41st with some confusion so this chapter is not over so it won't get published today but we'll finish it up on monday yeah we'll finish this chapter up on monday oh Ugh. Fun, fun, fun. Today was a lot of fun. I will give you guys that. Today was a lot of fun. Ugh. Let's find someone to raid. <laughs> today was a lot of fun it was a lot of fun today let's see who's our life uh let's find someone I think I can spell writing. I know I can. R W W R I T I N G. I know there's a writing tag. Is it like there? No, there should definitely be people in the writing because I'm in the fucking writing category right now. Come on! It should at least pop my stream up. Come on. There's nothing. That's very weird. Hold on. <laughs> there we go. Okay. This should do it. <laughs> Okay, let's see. Oh, someone's doing uh, Nano or National Novel or whatever. Yeah, this person looks cool. We can check them out. <laughs> Fourth 20 minute sprint is done. Let us. Oh, they're like playing Two. with like one of the, the writer thingy. bots.
Nice. Yeah, we'll definitely go here. Slash raid. Sharing. Forge. There we go. Oh. Hmm? Oh. I'll drop a follow. You guys should too. You guys, today was amazing. Seriously. Seriously. Thank you so much, Aelin Creative, for the follow. She said my name right. Fuck yes. Fucking Ronbu called me alien. Ronbu called me alien. I felt ashamed. Ronbu called me alien. But she got it right, so major props. Uh. But let's head on over. I love you guys so much. Seriously, you guys are amazing. And I do this because of you and because I love hanging out with you guys. We got super fucking distracted today, but that is fine because it was amazing. So I love you guys so much. Seriously, go out, be amazing. And just remember to be awesome. Uh, no stream on Saturday because I'll be working. Uh, and then Sunday afternoon, probably do a Sunday night stream. And then we'll be back with Dragon's Instinct on Monday. So, love you guys so much. And I will see you Sunday afternoon. Sending the raid in 5, 4, 3, 2, 1. Love ya. See ya. Bye.